Oh, reboot. Who's this? Oh. Oh shit. He's still alive. 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 Hey, Jay, what's going on, man? Diagnose. Impaired vision, corrupted mind palace. Hello, kobold. Hello. Uh, all systems in low power mode defective. You had... Oh, you had a good night's sleep? That's awesome. How did the rest of your... Absolutely amazing stream go. Like, sub, 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 subs, subs. That was awesome. That was awesome. Sub train was rolling last night for you. Um, unable to stand, so light, left and right leg components have been compromised. What about my hand? There's, there's another one. My penis? No, you don't. What's the difference between us? We could start it now, pretty nice. Um, what am I looking for? What's the, not his hand. Oh, what's this? Uh, corrupted audio data is damaged. Okay. Replace legs, L1. Yeah, the subtrain was nice last night. I did have to cut off a little early due to leg exhaustion, but I may have found a way to make it work without that problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Switch around your... I would switch around your exercises, to be honest with you. Um, I would, I would, I would do some, I would do some stuff at the desk. Like, leg exhaustion would be a big thing for you going back and forth, back and forth to that spot. Every death, it'll be every third death, do them all. You could do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. I just like, yeah, you, you would be exhausted from doing that. Hey, Psychorat, what's going on, buddy? How are you? I I can't believe this guy's still alive. Like, alive. I am playing Detroit Become Human slash Android slash Mexico slash Russia slash Canada. That's what it's called. They changed the name of the game. Oh, he has no legs. Oh. Shit. Shit. So I'm guessing the sun got rid of him. Man, this is... Oh. Right leg functioning. Okay. Now I need a left leg. Uh, you're doing great. Keep going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, right leg component. I found it. Which Yakuza games did you need to buy? Uh, three, the three, four, and five. Like the three, four, five, six, and seven. <laughs> Judgment. <laughs> I have, I have, I played zero and I have zero. One and two. I have already available to me. I have one. Roy has two. Uh, three, four, and five come in that collection that I'm waiting to go on sale. And then six and then seven. Because uh, seven is the new turn-based one. And then judgment. So I still have a lot to get. Three, four, five, six, seven, and... Oh, wait, wait, wait. It will be on today's sale. Ooh. Ooh. I'm going to pick that up then. I'm going to pick that up. Ugh. Part one. R1. I'm super proud of you, Jay. That's freaking awesome. That's great. That must, It's got to be the most difficult thing in the world coming back from something like that, but you're doing awesome. And you well-deserved yesterday. Well-deserved. Only down from signing to $40. Hmm. Hmm. Is this really $79 for that collection? Uh, sit up. Sit up. Sit up. This is crazy. I'm gonna take this leg and I'm gonna jam it in. Ready? Ah! Oh! This is a crazy atmospheric like tone. This is in this is insane. I love it. I love it. 
escape the junkyard. Also feels good for the mental health to be able to do some sort of exercise, and it's got to be good to get back to normalcy, right? It's got to be really good. Like, right, I'm going to take a look at that um, after after stream. Thank you. I appreciate it. For the discounts. Okay, I'm going to take a look after. So creepy. I see you too, buddy. Thanks for the lurk. Find Jericho. This is creepy. This is like dead space vibes right now. I love this. Love this. Look at all those hands. Oh, and they're all moving. They're all moving. Oh, that's like a workout right there. You don't know how their next game is going to top it for you? Well, it's obviously going to be like a totally different aesthetic, right? Oh my god. Oh my god, this is crazy. Find optical unit, find pump regulator. And there's nothing that shows. Or they may go in a totally different route, right? Like they may not, they may not go in the route that um, of this type of game. Like they could go, they could do something else. Who knows? Who knows? Incompatible. Boo. Oh, Optical unit incompatible. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, oh, get up. It's good that every game they come out with is better and better. Yeah, you're right, they can go a different route. Did they do quantum, did they do, did they do that quantum, no, what was it called? Fuck, I played it too. Nothing shows because your optical unit is damaged. Yes, yeah, I, I caught that. That was a, that was a, uh, I think I even said that, yeah. What was their, damn, what was that game? Uh, spare, I'm not gonna kill you. They didn't do Quantum Break? Okay, okay. So their, their last one before this was Beyond Two Souls then. Yeah, no worries, Hatsune. All good. All oh, good. Can I... <laughs> Did I just knock you down? That's hilarious. Uh... Oh, fuck. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Really? Nothing still? That's a Remedy game? Oh, the people who did Control did that? Okay, their only games are Inigo Prophecy, Heavy Rain, Beyond Two Souls, Detroit. There was a small game before Inigo Prophecy, but not huge. Aki, did you play Inigo Prophecy? I played it on Xbox, original Xbox. Not the remaster, the original one. Yeah, it's so, I, I liked it. To be honest with you, I don't believe their games got better and better. I thought Indigo Prophecy, like this game is amazing and it's probably going to be my top game of it, but I liked Indigo Prophecy more than I liked Heavy Rain. So, yeah. Oh, you didn't like IP? I loved the story in Indigo Prophecy. Absolutely loved it. I thought it was so good. No, please. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. I can't find anything. Uh, 
Uh, optical unit is incompatible. The last fight was anime? Yeah, it was. <laughs> it really was. Well, there were two endings because it was such an old... It was like a, their first foray into attempting something like that, right? So, like, you gotta give them credit. You gotta give them credit for, like, attempting something like that. Um, especially with what they had available to them. Like, they had an Xbox. Like, give me a break. It was called Fahrenheit because it came out... I believe it came out over in Europe first. That was the PAL name. So the PAL name was Fahrenheit. The um, Indigo Prophecy was the Western name for it. Okay, I'm not... I'm not sure. what I'm looking for here. Uh, L1. Thing is, I don't even know what that is. I don't have the strength, okay. I don't have the strength. What about you, buddy? Hey, compatible! Nice. Nice. Put it in you. Put it in you. Uh, R1. Come on. Come on. And then give it a good slam. Uh, Fahrenheit was the name of Inigo Bravs in North America to avoid confusion with the 2004 film Fahrenheit 9-11, a point of contention between Cage and Atari. There you go. There you go. Yeah, I knew it was over... I know in the east side it was called Fahrenheit, right? So... I really liked Indigo Prophecy. I thought it told a really good story. It wasn't beautiful. It wasn't like, yeah, it wasn't that type of game. It wasn't, but it like, I thought the story was great. Loved every second of it. Um, audio processor, ooh, ooh, open. Break. I uh, insert. Oh. Oh. Ha! <laughs> That's amazing. Love it. Love it. My optical is still off though, right? That audio design is friggin' beautiful. How they did that. Oop. Um, oh, that's compatible too. Oh, shit. These are all defects, right? That's crazy. Really hope they don't change and make something super different. They're like my favorite game company. I can't wait for the next game, but it's still years away. Did they, have they mentioned anything about a new game or do they just have like job positions open? Oh. Oh, Deviant, right, right, right. Right. They're Deviant. Deviant. <laughs> hey! 
Bike Ride. Thank you for the $33.24. I believe that's $40. I believe that's 40 bucks. Thank you very much for the kind donation. That's awesome. Thank you, thank you. That's, uh, yeah, that's $40.11. You're awesome. I'm going to buy that. Thank you. That's incredible of you. Very, very kind. Very, very kind. Thank you, thank you. We're going to we're going to go back to the Yakuza train. These couldn't all be deviants. Some probably just stopped working beyond repair. So then they would be if they weren't deviants, they would be the word that I said. Now I forget what I said. This is just the trash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sycharat, thank you for the thank you for the forty dollars and eleven cents defects. Yeah, yeah. So some of them are probably defects, and some of them are deviants, right? Yeah. Have a good day at work, man. Thank you again for the uh, kind donation. Okay, so I can climb now, right? No one's gonna stop me! I wonder if you can fall all the way down. This music music I love that you're still alive love it that's incredible incredible scene Hey, good morning, Ed Walker. How are you, buddy? What's going on? Have you started playing the village yet, Ed Walker, or did you pick it up at all? Rip off. Oh. Oh. Oh, is that like the controlling chip? Interesting. So now he has no barriers? Or it has no barriers? My name is Marcus. Oh, it has a... Does it have a consciousness now? Shit. I've started, I'm having fun, but I wish it was more horror-oriented like 2, 3, and 7. I'm on the opposite fence. I'm uh, I'm actually very, very happy that... Ooh, I, I missed one thing. I'm very happy that it's action-oriented like 4. Um, I actually said the game was better than 7. So, there's and everyone's on the different side of the fence there, right? The people who actually love the horror like aspect of seven are, are like disappointed. They, they still like it, but are disappointed it's not like that. Where I was like, oh, I love that it's going back to what four was, which is like all action heavy and uh, more of a thrill ride than a, more of an adventure game than anything, right? So, yeah, I loved it. It was good, it was great. No spoilers here for you, but oh, such a good game. Such a good game. Okay, November 6, 2038. Honor. Go well, back to Kana. Find Amanda. If they were deviant, those who own the android would pay for repairs before it got to that point. Well, unless they, unless they didn't want them, right? So if you can, you can also like have something that you don't want and throw it out. I'm, I'm guessing. Like I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Find Amanda. Uh, just scrap them and buy a new model. Well, it's like the, it's like what that fat guy did with the, um, with the, where the douchebag did, but he like broke his and then got the same model again. Just, they had him fix it apparently, but yeah. 
And some people might not have the money for the repair, exactly. Because they're homeless, right? What is this? Oh, is that for a human hand? Androids can't do that. Uh. Uh. So androids can't enjoy things like that? That's interesting. I think that's Amanda. Maybe. Or maybe that's just someone else. Uh, it's an RE game. It's supposed to be a horror game. Just make a new IP, do the action stuff, or do what they did in RE7, where Ethan's part was horror, and then you play as Chris. But, what? But, like, RE4 wasn't... RE4 wasn't really a horror game. RE4 was more of an, like, an action, like, thrill adventure game. Same with, like... Same with, like, RE5 and RE6. They were, like, action games. And then RE7 went back to the horror, and now RE8 is going back to, like, 4, 5, 6. From, from like, what I felt. Uh, you scrap them and buy. Some people might not have the money. I played RE7 recently and loved it, planning on buying. RE7 was great. Uh, I loved it. Oh, I liked RE5. I wouldn't say RE5 was terrible. I liked playing RE5. RE6, maybe. I played a bit of it, not a lot of it. Like, maybe, like, 10% of it. But people say RE6 is terrible. Um, but RE4 was great. RE4. And I'm excited for the remake. Uh, so I think this is Amanda. But I want to walk around a bit first. I agree. So I'm actually... I, I'm, I didn't... I'm not enjoying Returnal. I, uh... I... You might enjoy it. I'm just... I'm not enjoying Returnal. To be honest with you. RE8 was way better. Way, way better than Returnal. Yeah. You got the secret ending? That's awesome. You have to beat the game once, right? And then you have to do something again. Connor Mark 1. Oh, they have gravestones for this stuff? Oh. That's interesting. <laughs> it was not worth it. It explains nothing. How? What did you think of the game in general, though? Like, did you enjoy your experience with the game? Because I honestly didn't. It was okay. It was fun for a bit. But then I didn't. I didn't enjoy it after that. I was like, it's just the, just the pattern. I just didn't enjoy the pattern. I just was not. I was not a fan of it. And I thought it was just like, it was like they just put a new coat of paint on the same rooms. I don't know. I don't know. wasn't wasn't my cup of tea. I think that's it. I'm going to walk over here, and then we're going to... I went around the entire circle, right? Oh, here's a new one. Yeah, see, we can't touch that. We can't touch that. Right. It doesn't let us. Weird. Weird! Uh, gameplay action was okay, but they made a lot of game design mistakes when it comes to roguelikes. When Hades exists for far less money, you've got to do better. Yes. Agreed. Agreed. I thought the audio design was great. Uh, I thought the haptic feedback stuff was cool. Um, it seemed like they just went with that. That was what they were trying to go with the cool aspect of it. But the gameplay itself, the, like, I don't know. I just didn't, didn't enjoy it. Didn't enjoy it. But I'm glad we're on the same page for that. Not on the same page for RE8, though. Come on, man. Gotta get better. Connor, it's good to see you. I expected you to find the deviant who killed that man. I do find Resident Evil games to be too short, though, for their price tags. To be honest with you. I'm sorry. I know I should have succeeded. Never. Uh, you liked RE7 more than RE4. RE4 was so stressful for me. The experience was worse to me, so I hope I'll enjoy RE8 more. Well, RE8 is like RE4 in the sense of its play style. Uh, RE7 was a horror game. 
So RE7 was more like if you were to play Outlast, uh, things like that. Better, but I mean, that's that's what that game is like. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I get, I get what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. We're on the same page. You enjoy RE8, I enjoy RE8. I loved RE7 as well. I just, yeah, I prefer the gameplay from RE8. You prefer the gameplay. Or you prefer the cinematic experience that 7 presented you. Yeah. Right. Um... Intriguing. I think he's irritable and socially challenged. But I also think he used to be a good detective. He's an intriguing character. Unfortunately, yeah, we screwed up with Connor. With we didn't solve that mystery. What do you think is the best approach? Um, adapt. I will adapt to his personality. Oh, she didn't like that. The investigation that I avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. He did not like that. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. Oh. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. She did not like that answer, Continue though. Continue your investigation and put a stop to this. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. She is, is she like the CEO god of all these things? That's what it seems like. Look for Lieutenant Anderson. <laughs> Hank! Uh, I can talk to you. Joint Chiefs of Staff. And Walker, have you played uh, Detroit Become Human before? Apparently, all I can do is talk to you. Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yeah. Yes. Connect. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. Is that all I can do? I can wait at his desk. It was pretty good for the genre. So there is about three or four people in here that say that this game is in their top five of all time games. I think Hatsun said that. Uh, Aki, this is her favorite company. Her favorite company makes these games. So I would say that these are her favorite games. Uh, and there's there's a couple others. Uh, whose desk is it? Person? There's supposedly something that I can do here. Why are you... That was Kara's owner dude that walked by. Oh. Oh, like the douchebag? Oh. Oh, I didn't even recognize him. I'm looking for Lieutenant Anderson's desk. Shit. It's that desk right there. Um, okay, let's keep looking at this stuff. I just want to check everything before I sit down and wait. Doesn't seem to be anything else that I can, like, interact with. Oh, magazine. Magazine. Unlock the magazines. He's going to file a report on Kara, yeah. Figured that was going to happen. Figured that was going to happen. Um, 
what else do we have here? Desk, desk. Don't know what. Oh, this? I can talk to you? Oh, I can't talk to you now? You were gonna let me talk to you, and now I can't talk to you. Damn it! I was gonna sit down, right? And now I can talk to him. There we You're go. Still here? I thought your assignment was over. It's just been extended. Hank's gonna be overjoyed to hear that. So now I'm just sitting down. Guessing I'm just sitting in this chair and waiting. Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. <laughs> Thanks. Are androids always punctual? Are they always like on time to the is that's that's what they would be, right? There'd be no reason for them not to be. Captain Fowler is unavailable right now. I love how he's holding the phone away from his ear. Can't go in there. Did I save the little girl in the first mission? Yes. Yes, I did. Oh, place hands inside circles. What? 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 What are you looking at? Hey, fuck you. <laughs> Still looking at you. Is he gonna turn again? Uh, they're never late nor early. They arrive precisely when they mean to. Very true. Very, very. True. Uh, restroom. Wait, these ones work? Oh. oh. Go back to Hank's desk? Nah. Can I listen to this interrogation? No? Apparently not. Apparently not. Uh, this is a restroom as well? You look good, man. You look good. Damn right you do. Damn right you do. Oh, the voice actor for Connor actively streams on Twitch with his wife. More and more big name streamers are voice acting in games now. Very it too. <laughs> Look at that. It seems Hank has a new partner. Fucking plastic detective. <laughs> hey, you was drinking, buddy? You gonna bring him home when he's too drunk to find his car? <laughs> uh, it stinks of booze. Uh, introduce. Hello, my name is Connor. 
Oh shit. Never seen an android like you before. Mother. RK800. That was on my chest, buddy. A prototype. Android detective. What model are you? Don't read it on my chest. So machine's gonna replace yeah, us all. Yeah, Leo can't read. Is that it? Hey, bring me a coffee, dipshit. Get a move on! I gave you an order. I'm sorry, but I only take orders from Lieutenant Anderson. Oh, oh. <laughs> When a human gives you an order, you obey. Shit. Got it? Stay out of my way. Next time, you won't get off so easy. Really? You're all right, buddy. You're an android. You don't feel pain. Ooh, a donut. Ooh, donut. I just got punched, but ooh, donut. Um. Yeah. Oh, hello. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. Hank! In my office. Guy's great. Um, learn about examine his desk. He loves the headbanging music. Knights of the Black Death, Dark Heavy Metal. Um, analyze. Ooh, donuts! Brian's channel is where these emotes came from. Oh, nice. Nice. Getting your Twitch fame from a game. Cold coffee, traces of caffeine. Oh. Uh, Anti-Android slogans. Baseball cat, Detroit. Uh, matches. Okay. Real police. A good... Oh, jeez. Uh, canine hair. St. Bernard dog. Oh. Oh. Analysis complete, eh? Uh, just made a network of red ice dealers. And those are just those. Okay. He was a decorated officer. Was. Was a decorated officer. Now is not. Progress the case. Listen to the briefing. It hits the fan. I want you to investigate these cases and see if there's any link. Why me? Why do I gotta be the one to deal with this shit? I am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case. Can I go in there? I can barely change the settings on my own phone. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit! The truth is I love how the conversation just continues. And you let me hold in the bag. Cyberlife sent over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. 
No fucking way. I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation is over. Sir. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen, I've had just about enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. This guy hates androids, like with a passion. Probably because they're taking over work, but... I'm very pleased to have joined the team. I can assure you I'll do my very Close best... Close the door on your way out. <laughs> Have a nice day, Captain. Except, I was an idiot and said the wrong things during the case that we just did. Progress the case. There are two things that are locked right now. Progress the case. Hmm. I'm guessing those things would be available if I... Yeah. Oh, last night. I'm sorry I bothered you at the bar last night, Lieutenant. If I had solved the case, I right? I guess I ruined your evening. Right. In any case, I'd like you to know I'm very happy to be working with you. I'm sure we'll make a great team. Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. Uh, analyze deviancy file. Um, ooh. Ooh, lots of stuff unlocked here, dog. You have a dog, right? How do you know that? The dog hairs on your chair. I like dogs. <laughs> I like dogs. What's your dog's, What's your dog's name? name? Oh my god. What's it to you? Sumo. I call him Sumo. You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three-point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what I was watching at the bar last night. <laughs> you dipshit. Uh. Do you listen to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. You listen to heavy metal? Well, I don't really listen to music as such. But I'd like to. Hey! Friendship. Now I don't know if I really feel like talking about anti-androids to him. But I'm going to. A lot of people don't appreciate having androids around. I was wondering... Is there any reason in particular you despise me? Yeah. There is one. <laughs> <laughs> ah, good conversation. So we came out of that with nothing, so that's great. Have you known Captain Fowler for long? Yeah, too long. I was wondering, do you always arrive at the office at this time? Oh, I shouldn't ask that question. I arrive when I arrive. <laughs> Stop busting my balls, okay? Uh wanted to ask you questions, buddy. If you have any files on Deviants, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminal's on your desk. Knock yourself out.
Uh, I'm missing Gordon Lopez. You need to treat police department. Plaintiff reports that he left his Android at home as usual when he went to work. When he returned, the Android was nowhere to be found. No trace of a break in the apartment. The Android may have left the home without being ordered to. Plaintiff claims to have been attacked by a model Android working as a waiter in the Fast Coney Dogs restaurant chain, Street 842. The plaintiff claims the Android lunged at him and unexpectedly attempted to strangle the man. Before leaving the scene, the Android remains at large. Plaintiff claims to have been attacked by her Android. The android also trashed several rooms in the house before taking flight. The manager of the Eden Club reported the explained the experience of a sex android. The android disappeared after accompanying a customer to his home and never returned to the club. Famous painter Carl Manfred was found dead in his home following an altercation between his android and his son. The latter's witness statement attested to the android behaving violently. The android is thought to be a prototype and was destroyed at the scene by attending officers. Jesus. Oh, here it is. The plaintiff claims he was violently attacked by his domestic android. The android has just returned from being repaired the previous day and had shown signs of aggression in the past. That's Kara. Two hundred and forty-three files. First dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX-400 is reported to have assaulted a man last night. That could be a good starting point for our investigation. <laughs> Let's go. Um... Understanding. I understand you're facing personal issues, Lieutenant. But you need to move past them. And hey, don't talk to me like you know me. I'm not your friend, and I oh, don't we didn't like advice, that. He okay? did not like that. All right. Hey, take a look at these samples yet? I've been assigned this mission, Lieutenant. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop. He is not. But things are gonna he be is nice. not happy with my answers. Lieutenant, uh, sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX400 that attacked the guy last night. It's been seen in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. I don't like that he's tense now. I'm saying all the wrong things. <laughs> uh. No, well, I got to know him. Oh my, but I made terrible answers. Hey, Hank got a lead. Wait, Hank can not get a lead? Oh. Oh, I wonder how that happens. Oh. I wonder how you would come across. So Hank is mad is the only choice that comes out of that. But he got a lead. I wonder when, when he wouldn't get a lead. I wonder what choice that would be. Still raining. But Alice still trusts me, that's good. Now, Ralph was in the other room when we went to bed. Uh, I can revive the fire. I'm gonna look at this stuff first. I'm gonna read these books. Canada is still an android free zone. Oh. 
Oh. Yo, Canada! Uh, Carl, Gara was on the fireplace side when they went to bed, but waking up, it's Alice on the fireplace side. Ah, uh, she could have just switched sides. Maybe she was uncomfortable. <laughs> well, it's an android, so she can't be uncomfortable. Maybe she just switched sides of the night. During the night. Urban farm area. Where is... Where is Ralph? Oh. <laughs> I see the liberals are NDP or in power in this feature. <laughs> Android free zones, baby. Um, what am I doing? I'm looking at a bird. You saw the colors. <laughs> the colors were I get what that means. They'd be they would be pro worker. True. True. What is all this stuff? Dead bird. Oh, I could take money. I'm not going to take it. No. Nope, this playthrough, we do not do that. We do not steal money. My man. My man. That's right. Ooh. Arcade cabinet. What game is this? Out of this world. Free money and you don't take it? Who are you? Oh, change appearance? Oh. Oh. Oh, I shouldn't change my appearance until I wake her up, though. Um, find new clothes. What is it? Wake, wake Alice? Wait till Alice wakes up. Mommy! Nice jacket. Sweet. Sweet. Look at that look. Look at that look. A single set of clothes inside a random closet. How it should be. How it should be. Where's Ralph? Cut my hair, cut my hair. Chop. Chop. Ooh, don't put it in the sink, you'll clog it. Bad. Oh. Whoa, you did a good job of cutting your own hair in like friggin' 10 seconds. Ooh. Ooh. Let's do. Let's go. Let's go white. I like it. What does blonde look like? Oh, that looks good too. Black. Let's do, let's go blonde. Let's go blonde. Yeah. Remove? Oh, shit. Shit. 
shit. So doing that removes, does that remove control? Is that like a GPS tracker? Like what, what is that exactly? Oh shit, wait, 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 turn on. Oh. Who are you? Uh uh All right. Oh shit. Where to go? Oh, it's for people to know that they're androids, okay. In case anybody saw anything. Okay, well, let me know if they turn anything up. What are you going to do with that? What are you going to do with that? No idea. It took the first bus that came along and stayed at the end of the line. Its decision wasn't planned. It was driven by fear. Androids don't feel fear. Deviants do. They get overwhelmed oh. by their emotions and make irrational decisions. All right, well, that still it shows the stat it. of androids, whether they're deviant or not. Have a plan. Awesome. And it had nowhere to go. Maybe it didn't go far. So I'm guessing red is deviant, blue is Maybe. following orders, and yellow is processing something. <laughs> Ralph found this to feed the little girl. Good for her. A present. To make up for past misunderstandings. <laughs> Ralph will cook. We will do just like humans do. <laughs> humans like burnt meat. <laughs> Come. Come and sit down. <laughs> follow. Follow what he's asking. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> Ralph went to a lot of trouble to find something for the little girl to eat. Wouldn't be polite for her to refuse, would it? <laughs> Great. Oh. Secret. <laughs> succulent, you'll see. Succulent. Succulent. <laughs> oh, it could mean stress. Ooh. Please, Good. Clara. I don't want to eat that. What did she say? She said she can't wait to eat it. She's very hungry. The little human is not Oh, Alice's ready. thing went up? Ralph found the best. The Why best did Alice's trust go up on that? <laughs> this is going to be succulent. Succulent. <laughs> go ahead. Eat. Oh. Whoa. I'm gonna ask about the corpse. I saw the body upstairs. You killed that human, didn't you? No. No, he was like that when Ralph found him. You said you wanted to be like a family, Ralph. Father, mother, the little girl, remember? A father would never threaten his little girl with a knife to make her eat. Ah, nicely done. Nicely done. Ralph went to a lot of trouble. That's why. He just wanted the little girl to eat. But Ralph is not bad. No. Not bad. Then let us go. Anybody home? Oh, shit. There's blue blood on the fence. I know another android was here. Um, shit.
Damn it, the story's coming together. We're gonna arrest her. I'm gonna play that kind of cop. No, I'm just kidding. Lots of stuff for me to look for. Don't be afraid. I'm not gonna hurt you. Uh, signs of software instability, probably a self-destruction moderate. Irreversible skin damage probably cause extreme heat. Oh. Oh, if that's extreme heat, then that's not from the, the baseball bat from Carlos. I need to make his stress go down. Oh. Oh. I'm looking for an AX400. Have you seen it? Ralph seen nobody. Um Are there any other androids here? Other androids? No. Ralph is alone. There's blue blood on the fence. I know another android was here. Ralph scratched himself coming through. That's Ralph's blood. Oh no, I put the thing there, damn it. Damn it! Androids don't need heat. Okay. Table set for three people. Food androids don't eat. Find the source of stress. is telling the truth. I don't want to get them in trouble. No. Hey, Lady Kilola. Hello. Hello. Um, that's it. I have nothing else to look at. I think that's. I think that's everything. Can I, can I go back upstairs? 
Oh. Oh, I'm looking for... Oh. Run quicker! <laughs> Connor, what's going on? It's here. Call it in. Which way did it go? That way. They're headed for the train. I love how he's just standing there. That cop. Matrix. They're over there. Yeah, you guys don't. No, it's getting away. Don't shoot. We need it alive. Oh, we need it alive. Oh. Whoa, what? Oh, do we have to run across this? Holy shit. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh, fuck. That's insane. Holy shit, I thought I got clipped there. I thought I got clipped there. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Hey. Can't let them get away. They won't. They'll never make it to the other side. I can't take that chance. Uh, you will get yourself killed. Uh, Do not go after him, Connor. That's an order. Oh my god, I got clipped. Oh my god, I got clipped. Oh my nose. My nose is itchy. Holy oh, shit. <sighs> Who's my favorite character so far in the game? Um I think that Jackson from Grey's Anatomy is badass for that one scene with him putting his legs back on and doing whatever, but but Kara's my favorite so far. Car is definitely my favorite so far. Run, Kara, run, run, Kara, run. Yes. Did I miss a whole? Oh, there's so much you can do. So Kara and Alice reach middle section. Hank orders Connor not to go, but then Connor can go. Jesus. Oh, but if Connor goes, something immediately happens. Like, if you let Connor go, there's only, like, one choice that happens right there in the end for something. Oh. Did I attack Leo? Leo was... Who was Leo again? I missed a hole? I don't know what hole is. Carl's son. Um... Carl. Oh god, now I'm forgetting names. Reach for the sky. Hey, Carrick. Thanks for the stretch, buddy. Oh. Oh, my back. My back. Um, hold on. Hold on. Who was... Oh, Leo's the... No, I didn't attack Leo. Leo was the guy in the, um... Is Leo the cop that attacked me? Oh. Oh, that's Gavin. That's Gavin. Never mind. No, I didn't attack. I did not attack Leo, um, which got me shot in the head. And then I, yeah, so there was that part. So right here, Connor obeys Hank's orders. Oh, if I didn't reach the middle section, I would have, something would have happened. Oh. 
Connor obeys Hank's orders, or Connor could not obey Hank's orders, and then there's a whole friggin' other scene. Okay. 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 Got it. Got it. Got it. That Cyberlife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. Although police assistant androids have existed for several years now, this would be the first case of an android being authorized to play an active role in criminal. I'm gonna miss out on one of your favorite scenes. Shucks. We're gonna play it again after, and I'm gonna do all the choices differently. How are you, Lady Keela? How's uh, Fox Trot doing? How's your uh, How's your first child? Oh shit! Find Jericho. Check symbol. That's a badass coat. Love that. Look for graffiti. They missed you. Did you spare some change? I can't, buddy. Sorry. I don't need money. I don't need money. Really? Uh, another book, though. Yeah, yeah. Is that... Oh, that's Kara. Android on the run. Oh. Oh. Android astronauts to explore IO. She's good. We had a good night last night. She didn't whine too much in her crate. Awesome. Are you Oh, there it is. Are you guys doing um what kind of training are you doing? Are you doing uh, like shot collar training or are you just are you going to do shot collar training or are you just doing like basic like seeing how it goes first? Find the symbol. Oh, there it is. Uh, next graffiti is... Ooh. The yellow... Yellow face. Uh, shot collars aren't barbaric. Uh, there's a misconception with shot collars. Um, a lot of dogs do need that uh, in order to be... Well, you have to believe in it because if they exist. You mean you don't you don't like using them or you wouldn't use them. If you don't believe in it, then it's like people saying, like, they don't believe in something that actually exists in this world. But I get where you're coming from. But I'm, I'm, I'm pro if... If it, it's needed, it's fine. Um, it's not good to torture a pet with it. It's not good to do whatever. But for training purposes, I do find that they are needed in some instances. <laughs> Humans don't use stairs. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. Um... I'm still looking for this graffiti. I'm going to talk to you. Hey, Rider Mine. How are you, buddy? Thank you for using Cyberlife's Android parking service. Do you know where Jericho is? Spaces are available. Mm, see, they ignore. That's the second time that's happened. How are you, Rider Mine? What's going on? Um... Oh, it's this right here. Is this it? Yeah. It is over here. Oh, there it is. Next one is on a wall with Two stars. Uh, I don't agree with you. I, I disagree with that. Um, I think that um, there's a lot of dogs out there that 
even though they can be trained, they are uh, still animals, and I still think that you can responsibly use a collar um, in a way that will help them uh, further in life. I think that it will it could be a difference between life and death in the end. So, but that's a, that's a that's a purpose of opinions. It doesn't matter. Like you just don't use one, right? So, but I do still think that they are. Um, very much a need dependent on certain things. You can be the best trainer in the world, the dog is still has a wild mind and anything could happen. So you, there's certain ways that you have to train animals and sometimes that's a matter. But you don't have to, you don't have to hurt an animal with it. You don't have to, you don't have to use it to its full capacity. A shock collar still is just a vibration it's not actually using electricity to shock them that way. It's a pincer around the neck that it vibrates at certain um, decibels, right? So you can have it very low still. It's just a reminder to them. It's like it's like shaking it so that it, they're reminded that they need to, to be there. So that's where the misconception is. People think that they're shocking the dog, but they're not doing that. That's like having the electric fences. Um... Not all of them. So that that was the old like people used to use those ones, but now they're not. Now they're vibrations. Now they're now they're pure. Like they have the edges on them that go into the neck, and now what they do is they vibrate. So, so if you're buying like pure shock collars with electricity and stuff like that and shocking your dog, then that's not good. But yeah, yeah, they're just not called vibration collars. They're called shock collars. Because they give the dog a shot. The idea is that, oh my god, it's going, it's like, it's, oh, you've upped the amount of, that it vibrates, right? Um, what am I looking, oh, I'm going, oh shit, no, no, can't cross, can't cross. Red. What else am I looking for? Um, I, like, there doesn't seem to be much else to do outside of this. Can I just go across and get hit? Like, it seems to be against the law to go when it's red. I'm not going to walk. I'm not going to walk. Can I... Can I go across? Oh, there we go. Um... Go here, here, who has been updated. The next one is behind a fence on top of a robot. Behind a fence on top of a robot. Um, let's go across the road again. Ooh, ooh, I bet you it's over here. I bet you it's over here. No, I'm sorry. Can't give you any money. Behind a fence. Oh, there it is. There it is. There's one. There's two. I think that's the third one right there. I don't see a... Oh. Hold on. Hold on. No, I'm gonna leave a... It's gonna cut me, right? Oh no, it's not, okay. I gotta move this, I gotta move this. Next one is a face with it on the left hand side. Face with it on the left hand side. Oh, there it is. There it is. Anything in here? There's one. 
I'm guessing more on the other side of this. Find a way to reach the roof. Oh, here we go. I like his jacket. His jacket's really cool. That he found. Um, that's it. Do you believe they're unethical? As I said, teach their own. I, I, I don't. I, I have seen success stories with them uh, firsthand. So, from dogs that have been like untrainable. Dogs that you you may think that you can train any type of dog, you can't. Like there are some dogs that are, um, there's some dogs that were are beaten by their owners and left alone, and there's some that are just wild and crazy and stuff like that. And people just put them down or people do whatever, and they can't train them. Um, and even uh, what is it? Like the dog whisperer says, sometimes you do need to take action in that sense, and it's not hurting the dog. It's not doing anything like that. You're not, you're not putting, you're putting them into like, it's just, it's like scolding a child in a way. It's just like, it's that way. You shouldn't, you should never yell at your child, but you have to be stern. You have to be whatever. And that's the way they don't understand why, like dogs in that stance of like when they, there's so much fear involved and there's so much whatever, and they, they need to, they need to be brought back into the world, need to whatever. They just need to understand that not, not everything out there is out there to like, hurt you and kill you and do whatever and being nice to it sometimes works with some dogs but sometimes they just need to like you need to start from scratch you need to be very slow and you need to make sure that they don't go wild and they don't just go attacking people because they fear whatever like it's yeah there's a lot of there's a lot of different things but i don't i i don't find them unethical no um so we got two so far but there should be a third one um, but I don't know if it's on this side. That's one, two. Can I? I can't just jump to the other side, right? No. No. You see it? Um, am I being dumb? Is it still on this picture? One, two. Yeah, it's not on the picture anymore. Oh, it still is on the picture? Oh. One, two. Where is it? I don't see it. Oh, oh wait, wait. There we go. Got it, it was, oh, it was white. Oh, I was looking for something that's black. I gotcha, I gotcha. Use the right stick to select. Oh. <laughs> You're gonna run on the wall? I only have these two choices. One, two. Hell yeah. That's great. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Next to the word sparkle. Parkour, parkour. Always makes me want to watch The Office. Always makes me want to watch The Office. Parkour, parkour. Drop. Um... L2. Oh, you know what I didn't do? I didn't restart my stream labels. 
Today should be at zero. There you go. Uh, we're looking for the word sparkle. There it is. Number one. Number two. And number three. Inside the place. Inside the place. Pre-construct. I could go that way. I could go that way. Okay, let's try this way first. Okay. Ooh, it would be too unstable. Try this way. Okay. Ooh, it would be too high. Okay. Okay. Oh, what about over here? All right. Good for you. Go, buddy. I wish this was how life worked, eh? You will not get hurt if you do this route. Awesome. It seems like it's chopping sometimes, like it stops. Uh, I'm looking for something inside here, which is, I believe, yeah, see, it's like chopping. That's the graffiti I'm looking for. And I'm looking to get in there. That's where I came from. Something with wood against it. Oh. I don't think the chopping is the game's fault. What do you think it is? I don't know why it's like, it's like stopping every once in a while. It's really weird. never never done that before uh let's remove these It's got, it's pro it has to be the game's fault in some way though, because I, like, I'm on a PS5. It's gotta be something making it do that. Jericho, we found it. Yeah, it's, do you see it like stutter every once in a while? Yeah, it's just happening today. I don't know what's going on. Um. Oh, shit. That wasn't good. I should have looked before I did that. I can go that way. Yeah. Get up there, buddy. Get up there. Um, we're gonna keep going this way. Yeah. Find another way on the boat. I'm gonna go this way first. That's beautiful. This game's really pretty. Like, really pretty. 
Even though it's mostly all like quick time stuff and like, yeah, it's still really pretty. Very well done. That's crazy. Ooh. I'm so glad this guy is still alive. A nice Assassin's Creed reference. Yeah, the diving from the diving from the top into a hay bale. Except this time there's water. Uh, I do. So the only reason I like Marcus right now to be honest with you, is because I watched Grey's Anatomy all the way through. <laughs> so it's kind of like a, a soft spot for him. For the actor, but yeah. Explore the boat. Yeah, yeah, that's why. Other than that, probably if I didn't know him, I'd be like, eh, but like I know him as an actor, so it's kind of like, Oh, kind of like an attachment like that. It's locked. It's a locked. It's locked. Ooh, ooh. Lots of doors to check out here. Hey, gamer. How are you? What is going on, buddy? Everybody's in blue today. Was there nothing in here? Really? Really? Ew. Ew. Eighty-five endings in Detroit Become Human. Eighty-five? Man, we got a lot of gameplay to go. I wonder if Aki got all eighty-five endings. I wonder if she's even around. Aki! I don't know which one I'm going. I think she went this way. That was an obvious and predictable jump scare. That was the first jump scare in this entire game. Absolutely not. Google says that, but you don't know. Oh, damn. Wait, is Aki even here anymore? There she is. I don't know where she is. Ooga booga! That was a jump scare right there. That wood dropping scared the shit out of me. Man, all these doors are freaking locked. Can you, can you not walk through that door? Can you, can you not? Are your controls broken? Oh. This environment is built for jump scares. I'm just a wuss. Any environment is built for a jump scare for me. 
I'm waiting for those uh, things from Dead Space to come out so I can chop off their limbs. Oh, it sounds like the alien from Alien Isolation is going to come out and get me. Gamer, you scared me. You were a ghost? Jesus. Google says there's a lot of overlap, so it would be closer to around 40 endings. Oh. But I guess technically he's right, though. If there's 85 endings, even with the smallest tweak, it's still 85 endings, right? Oh. Oh. Who are you guys? Welcome to Jericho. Jericho! I barely missed anything. That was like, that was a very linear thing, right? So what did I miss over here? I didn't get something before I crossed the gap. And I didn't get something when I left the streets. Okay. This game is the grandfather of different paths. Ooh, buddy. Do you think that this is the grandfather of different paths? Ugh. Man. You gotta play choose your own adventure games. You gotta read Choose Your Own Adventure, like, books that were turned into games. This is like a child of different paths. Oh. Okay. Yeah, here we go. I did not do anything. <laughs> no, he says he's saying thank you for like t talking about like the overlap with endings and stuff. That's why. Plastic with you. A shit hot tip. There's the good cop and bad cop. All right. All right. That shit hot tip you gave me sent me back to You're Jersey. welcome, man. Come on, this is different. It's a hundred percent guaranteed. You can't go wrong. What am I scanning? Uh, this is Pedro Abdar, unemployed, criminal record, illegal gambling, and fraud. Lieutenant Hank Anderson does not have a criminal record. He is absolutely clean. This is Gary Kays. He's a business owner. Resisting arrest, breach of hygiene regulations. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> All right, I'm I had McDonald's yesterday. Street. I had a hankering for some... I get it? A hankering? Uh, I had... Like, I had a coupon for five, it was like five bucks for um, a Big Mac meal. I used it. What is your problem? Don't you ever do as you're told? I'm a legal business detective. Look, you don't have to follow me around like a poodle. Ooh, I could go for a Whopper too, yeah. Um. I think our relationship got off on the wrong foot. We should forget what happened. And start over. What do you say? <laughs> Look, they sent me a piece of plastic for a partner, and I'm dealing with it. But if you think we're going to be buddies, you're as stupid as you look. Let's just get some chicken. Let's just get some chicken. There you go. The hamburger. One thousand six hundred and eighty. Calories. I think that's what that says. I don't know what the K is for. 53% water. Extra large soda, 710 calories. Sugar, 184 grams. Carbonated pineapple passion. 
Uh, kilo calorie? A hamburger from a chicken place? Uh oh. Thanks, Gary. I'm stuck. Uh oh. Oh, you didn't get something for me? Here. Huh, not a chance. Follows me everywhere. I know. Androids don't eat. Blah 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 blah. Oh, that's gonna it's gonna do great for your insides, buddy. Um, company. I don't want to alarm you, Lieutenant, but I think your friends are engaged in illegal activities. Well, everybody does what they have to to get by. As long as they're not hurting anybody, I don't bother. Them. <laughs> that's that's a great that's a great thing. Uh, I don't want to talk about his gambling. I don't want to talk about his cholesterol because that'll just bring our friendship down. Do you eat here often? Most days. Gary makes the best burger in Detroit. <laughs> that burger looks yeah, yeah. Uh, highway. This morning, when we were chasing those deviants, why did Can you play Angry Birds in an Android? Absolutely. You could have been killed. Absolutely. I, and I don't like filling out paperwork for damaged equipment. Um Deviants. Maybe I should tell you what we know about deviants. You read my mind. Proceed. We believe that a mutation occurs in the software of some Android. How are you, Carrick? What's going on? What are you up to today? In English, please. That Carrick that Connor looks so realistic, you want to eat just him? Get overwhelmed <laughs> by irrational instructions, which can lead to unpredictable behavior. Emotions always screw everything up. The androids aren't as different from us as we thought. <laughs> um, about Connor. Is there anything you'd like to know about me? Hell, no. <laughs> well, yeah. Um, why do they make you look so goofy and give you that weird voice? Cyberlife androids are designed to work harmoniously with humans. Both my appearance and voice were specifically designed to facilitate my integration. Well, they fucked up. <laughs> yes, they did. <laughs> uh, Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Why do you hate Android so much? Android killed his wife? I have my reasons. Android did something. Were with Deviants before? A few months back, a deviant was threatening to jump off the roof with the little girl. I managed to save her. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. So I guess you've done all your homework, right? Know everything there is to know about me? Mr. Krabs? Yeah. Yeah. Same guy. Same guy. I know you graduated top of your class. You made a name for yourself in several cases and became the youngest lieutenant in Detroit. I also know you've received several disciplinary warnings in recent years, and you spend a lot of time in bars. <laughs> so what's your conclusion? I think working with an officer with personal issues is an added challenge, but adapting to human unpredictability is one of my features. Oh, oh what is he doing? I just got a report of a suspected deviant. Oh. It's a few blocks away. We should go have a look. So Hank, Hank's out. liking me a bit more. I'll be in the car if you need me. That music in the background? It's gonna get me DMCA'd. Hey, Connor. You run out of batteries or what? I'm sorry. I was making a report to Cyberlife. Uh, well, do you plan on staying in the elevator? No. I'm coming. We're becoming friends. Right, what do we know We're becoming friends. Not, not oh, shit, Pooper. How are you? What's going on? <laughs> I love that name. Oh, shit, Pooper. <laughs> How did you get that name on Twitch? <laughs> <laughs> uh, is there an audio desync again? Oh, maybe. You can just tell me later. You heard <laughs> I love that name. This floor. Oh, Nobody's shit, Pooper. Here, but 
The neighbor said he saw. Uh, hold on. Hold on. And hiding an LED under his cab. Oh, crap. What's Christ, this? We have to investigate What's every this? time somebody hears a strange noise. Feathers, Columbia, Olivia, rock, pigeon. We're gonna need more cops. Oh. oh. I guess you don't want me to look at that. Hey, were you really making a report back there in the elevator? Yeah, I was making a report. Just by closing your eyes? Yes. Correct. Shit. Yeah, wouldn't that be wish nice? <laughs> yeah, wish I could do that. How are you? Oh, shit. Hey, do you know what goes well with that? I, I have, a, I have a, a sound alert for you. Um, here you go. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! <laughs> uh, you have no idea how they accepted it? No idea. No idea, but that's awesome. There's your, there's your, I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> that's going to be your, uh, your, your thing now. Yeah, the name's great. We're going to have to knock down the door. Open up, Detroit police. Oh, shit. Stay behind me. Got it. You love that track? Yeah, it's awesome. That'll be anytime you come in now, we'll just play that. Oh shit! Oh shit. I gotta hold on. Let me walk normally. Let me walk normally. Let me look. Let me look. Oh, hold on. Hey! Thank you for the follow. For that follow, I present to you. I know I'm do I'm I know I'm overdoing it. I know I'm overdoing it. But oh shit, oh, shit, oh, shit. welcome, oh shit pooper. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. You are one of us. One of us. <laughs> Been following for twenty two seconds. Whoa, that's a lot of pigeons. Investigate the. Look at all these pigeons. You would be so sick in here, like. So sick. Jesus, this place stinks. Gross. Gross. Urban farms of Detroit, fruits and vegetables. Look at look at all these chickens. Um I should tear this down though. Wait. Wait, wait. Hold on. Hold on. So how are you, oh shit pooper? What? Oh, right there. No, we already did that. What's going on? I'm guessing you've played this game before. I'm guessing you've beaten it. I'm guessing you enjoy it. Oh, recycled paper recently moved. Well, uh, looks like we came for nothing. No. Our man's gone. Okay, I found that. Great. Come on. Come on. Look through it. Look through it. Keep the book. Keep the book. Found something? Yep, I did. I don't know. Um, let's keep looking. It looks like a notebook, but it's keep looking. indecipherable. Let's keep looking. Right. Suspect doesn't eat. So if the suspect doesn't eat, it's a deviant. Most likely. <laughs> Gamer. Gamer, you spelt my name wrong. There's two D's in my first name. Ah, you're suspended. Just kidding. But my name's spelled F-R-E-D-D. -D. There's two D's. I'm a, I'm a weird guy. I'm a variety streamer, apparently. I, I'm learning about myself. Fred is a variety streamer and is currently playing Detroit Become Human, as you can see. And we'll play other games. On, on, I'll play other games on the future. Also, we have a Discord. Oh, we have a Discord? Oh, it's our Discord. Gamer Fanatico. Oh. Well, if you'd like to join Gamer Fanatico and my Discord, then it's exclamation mark Discord. You, you are more than welcome to do that if you'd like to join. I also have a YouTube. But... Apparently, Gamer Fanatico also owns this YouTube. So we are doing YouTube and we're doing Discord together, apparently. So please, feel free. 
Actually, no, I don't have a poop shit four or five poop shit. What? What? Actually not. I don't have a poop shit four or five. Poop shit stands for P.S. What? It's a golden sword. It's my Discord. Well, looks like I lost my Discord. So, <laughs> oh well. Uh, what am I looking for here? Uh, military jacket, secondhand initials, RT. 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 Probably initials. He put his initials in his jacket? That's something your mom does when you're in first grade. Uh, processing Rupert Travis forgery. The driver's license is fake. Cool. At least we didn't come for nothing. Okay. Uh, this game is PS4 exclusive. No, it's on Steam. This game's on Steam. And I'm playing it on the PS5, but PS4, PS5, same shit, different pile. <laughs> it's my Discord now, everyone's scram. It used to be a PS4 exclusive, but you can play it on Steam now. Oh, they took out their chip. They took out their chip. Yep, yep. Have you played this game, uh, oh shit pooper? Its LED is in the sink. <laughs> I should just call you OSP. OSP! It was an android. No human could live with all these fucking pigeons. OSP is the OG. Uh, blue blood. Ooh. Ooh. You are a deviant. Oh. Any idea what it means? RA9. You have neither? Oh, okay. okay. Have you seen other people play this game before? The same sign Ortiz's Android wrote on the shower wall. Oh, you have neither. Like, you don't have a PS4 or a PS5. Okay. But you have Steam. You can get Steam, right? You have a computer. Looks like mazes or something. But you have to, I, I'm guessing you have to have a decent computer. These graphics are actually pretty, uh, pretty high up there. Obsessive compulsive writing. Eat. Uh, scan. This is recently disturbed traces of avian fecal matter. Love it. This is still wet, used recently, midnight mood, opened marker pen. Okay, so this guy was writing. Fell off the chair. Ran to the living room. Okay. Real books. Thought I was the last guy to try to keep No Steam? Oh, you don't have it. Oh, so you just haven't signed up for a Steam account. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Steam Xbox 360. All right. I used to have an Xbox. Electronic books you can't. The smell of paper see the pages oh it's on epic as well oh i didn't even know it was on epic there you go there you go get on that epic train uh recently broke oh oh and these are skid mark trail width traces of galvanized steel Um, where is, oh, there it is. Suspect is still here. Oh. So he ran from here. Knocked that away. That fell. Suspect heard us enter. Knocked that over. 
and then ran up there. Okay. Yellow. You have no idea what I'm talking about, do you? Um, that's it. I know where he is. I know where you are. Oh, he jumped down! He jumped down! You have an Xbox Series X? Oh, shit. Can you get it on... No, you can't. It's only on PlayStation and Steam and that, right? You can just put memes in the miscellaneous. It's all good. Fucking pigeons! What are you waiting for? Chase it! Let's go, let's go! Chase scene! Oh! I do have to push up. Oh, okay. Ooh. Uh. Okay. Balanced, safer. Uh. Go that way. Direct but crowded, safer detour. Going up here. Going up here. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Oh, yeah. You're done, buddy. You're done. You're done. I'm gonna catch you. I don't run out of breath. I don't run out of breath. Uh, safe as Here we go, here we go. I can't see anything, I can't see anything. No! 89% uh, chance of survival, okay. He's gonna survive, it was 89%, it was 89%. Serious malfunctions have been detected in your software, including class 4 errors. You've been deemed defective and will be sent back to Cyberlife. Oh, he survived. We're okay. Woo! <laughs> 89% chance of survival. We did it. Get him before he steals the secret formula. So, oh shit, Pooper, what games do you, are you playing right now on your Xbox Series X? Quick time events are your favorite in games? Yeah, oh yeah. I, I know some of the Resident Evil games do them as well. So we have stop being plankton from stealing the secret phone. Oh, you really want a meme thing, don't you? Just post memes and miscellaneous. Get over it. You bastard. You saw I was gonna fall and you'd rather let me die than fail your fucking mission. I had to make a choice. It seemed to me- What am I to you? A statistic? A zero, a one in your fucking program? Huh? Is that how you see humans, you bastard? Jesus. I understand you're upset. 
Perhaps I didn't assess the Fuck situation. you and your fucking <laughs> He's not happy. Come here. Why are you doing this? All right. You're one of us. Shut up. You're helping humans. But you're just their slave. I said shut up. So... I thought that he would be happy that I got the suspect. Oh. Holy shit. Fucking androids. <laughs> He's not <laughs> He is not happy about that. Ah uh... Catch it. What's catch it? Connor caught up with Rupert. Rupert committed suicide. Ooh. Gaining on Rupert, Rupert pushes Hank. Follow Rupert or... Oh, it would have been something else. Ooh. Ooh. I think everything else was fine. Find LED. Find the... Di oh, I found a diary, though. So that's good. Ooh, it could have ended a different way. Could have ended right there, I think. Shit. Yeah, we might have not found Rupert. And then it would have ended a different way. Oh, there's so many other things I didn't do. Join Hank, or I don't join Hank. Wait, if I didn't... That's just a side thing, right? Talk to Hank, don't talk to Hank. I think it would just continue. Okay. Oh, we're back here. Who are you? Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. No. Um, Jericho. This is Jericho? It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. Free. And hiding just to stay alive. That's freedom to you? Humans hate us. Hiding is the only way we can survive. There is no safe place for those like us. Hey, she looks familiar. If we were here, they'd kill us. How many are you? There are 19 of us still in working order. The rest were damaged escape. She looks like an actress that I many tried to reach Jericho. If you succeed, humans have little pity for our kind. I understand how you feel, but we have more freedom here than you ever did. Humans were your masters, and now it's fear that rules you. Uh, you know, freer than you. Amazed and scared because the load screens last than two seconds. On PC, they last less than ten seconds on an SSD as well. Just if you play it on Steam or Epic, and you put it on your SSD drive, it's like. All we can do now. Oh, you put it on your SSD. I don't have to say drive. It's super quick as well. Safe here. She was the sex android in the police report. Yes, she was. I think all of, all of these people were in the report, right? I see Lucy. She might be able to help you. Why haven't they taken out their chip, though? Um, find Lucy, explore Jericho. Now, they don't really need these. All these people weren't in the report? Some of them were, though. Some of them were. Who are you? Do you know what happens after death? No. No, I don't. Well, I'm about to find out. What? What's your name? Marcus. Marcus.
Oh shit. I was glad to meet you, Marcus. Oh. Oh. She shut down. No. That's sad. That's sad. Um, let's go f do some more of these fires. Do this one. Rest in pepperonis. Pepperonis. Who's this? Is that a child android? They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. Oh. He was living on the streets before we brought him here. They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. To help them, we need blue blood and bio components. We salvage what we can from those who shut How down. do you... I didn't know that they made child. So, how do they survive? Androids. They won't. We're slowly dying out. This is exactly like iRobot in the sense that there are older models that are dying out and newer models are replacing them. It's like it's it's exactly like that story. Crate already emptied. Oh, with new parts. Oh. One would want the I oh their I ideal child, right? Right. Interesting. Docks Western. Oh, Cyberlife Warehouse and Docks. Um what else? That's... Oh, let's start this fire, too. Her name is North. Um, Jericho. Who found this place? Nobody knows anymore. Whoever he was, his body's probably laying somewhere on this boat. Is this the... Is that the girl from Gossip Girl? I don't know. Well, these guys need spare parts and blue blood. Why hasn't anybody gone to... Seems like it. Maybe not. It's not that simple. Can't just go shopping at a cyber Maybe not. store. Anyway, nobody wants to risk leaving Jericho. I'm trying to remember what I, what I saw her from. A lot of these guys in pretty bad shape. Yeah, they wouldn't grow up, right? The kids wouldn't grow up. That's a good point. They'd be kids forever. Which would make them perfectly ideal for like sex trafficking and stuff like that. Oh. Oh. That sucks. Why it sucks? Um, maybe the rich people buy it for their kids, but I have no idea. Not in very good shape, am I? The diagnostic program isn't working. anything good to say anyway what happened to you they tied me to the back of a car <laughs> i wanted to have fun bless me i don't want to shut down sorry guys no i, I don't want to shut down
Some people wouldn't want their kid to grow up ever. That way their kid's innocence could be forever secured. Mm. You wouldn't want your kid to always be a kid. I don't see any, any human actually wanting that. Okay, I feel like I haven't unlocked something before I talk to her. So, it looks like I've, I've, I've got everything there. I'm gonna talk to her. Hello, Lucy. Are you Lucy? You can see some people wanting that. Sit hmm. down. The weird thing to want your kid to always be a kid. Show me. And not wanting them to grow up. And experience like what all those things are when you're an adult and crap like that. I'll stop the bleeding. I'm gonna cauterize the wound. Drink this. So that's blue blood. Oh, I drank it all. Jesus. Give me your hand. It's clean. Cold. And that's what I call high quality a duo. Cheers. Thank you. Appreciate it, Carrick. I like the veininess of her eyes. Really cool. Like below her eyes. You had it all. And you lost it all. Yep. Water! Well, mine's coffee, it's not water. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. Um, propose a plan to Simon. Propose a plan. Propose, and there's nothing else to do, right? Okay. What's up, Simon? Simon. Wake up. I know where we can find spare parts. The Cyber Life Warehouse is in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. Ooh. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Do they have to be charged up? Maybe it's worth a try. No. I'm in. So they just charge charge up by themselves, eh? Did I get every Oh I got everything! There was nothing I missed! Woo! It's my first one! That one was like the easiest one of them all. November sixth. Still raining, eh? My hair looks too dry on the front. She still doesn't have a change of clothes. Are you okay? We'll get some help here. As soon as we'll all be just a bad memory. Mm. 
like an abandoned house, but there's lights on, so not so much. The place. There it is again, there's no loading. What happens, my friend, when you have a solid state drive? Uh, hold on. Hold on. Take a look around. Okay, we're okay. Whose house is this? I'm gonna ring again. Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. Who's Zlatko? I told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. We really need your help. Come in. Yeah. Don't be shy. Um, yeah. Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Whoa! Oh, don't be afraid of our big friend here. Luther is just another android that I helped. He keeps me company in this big, empty old house. He's huge. Please. That guy just looked me up and down. Make yourselves at home. How did you hear about me? An android. Wait. On the street, he said you could help us. Luther can scan me and know that I'm an android, though. Right? Devian, huh? What about her? Oh, he. so he knows, obviously. She's human. And you want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. Yep. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Because Canada doesn't accept androids. Beautiful landscapes. Open spaces. But they Clean. never look for you either. And no androids. Right. Laws. Right. Great place for a fresh start. Yes, that's. That's exactly what we want. Of course. Well, I can help you. But first, we have to get rid of your tracker. Tracker? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. Oh, so you'd know where I am. I'll remove yours. And then you'll both be safe. Come on. Follow me. I don't trust this. Nope. 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 Hard no. Nope. No. She always stays with me. Of course. Nope. Right this way? Everything we need is in the basement. Oh, <laughs> I don't. No. No. I don't. Oh god, we just gotta go. Uh... Everything we need is in the basement. Uh... Don't trust it. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. 
Nope. Nope. I'm doing it anyway, but nope. I don't like this place, like this place either. Let's go. I have a bad feeling. Um. I know. I don't trust him either. We have to be careful. Oh God. Please excuse the mess. I needed somewhere discreet for my machine. Why did she let go of my hand? Removing track. Why did you let go of my hand? So Come here. I opted for discretion Come here. over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. No. No, she'll be all right. That's good. Oh, we unlock something. Something something just Hold on. Hold on. Something just got unlocked. So, oh, where's she going? Hold my hand. Hold my hand. Hold my damn hand. Come here. Come here. Enter his machine. If you could just stand over there. Hold on. Uh, don't. I don't trust this at all. <sighs> I should warn you, this could be quite unpleasant. Okay, so we unlocked something though. No! No. For some unknown reason, the trackers seem to stop working in Deviance. That's why it's so hard to find them. <laughs> so, actually, there's no reason. No! Tracker. What? But you said that. Yeah, the people believe what they want. You Deviants. No. So hey, Sakurai, what's up, buddy? Lunch time. They come to me expecting me to help them. And I just reset them. Sell them on. No, 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 no. For my little experiments. No! No, I, I don't want to be reset. Let me go. Ah! Oh, I forgot about the child. Um, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Alice! Alice, no! Shit. Shit! One month, five days, 22 hours. Good job, gamer. Oh god, I don't like this place already. Wow. A deviant that wants to be a mother. That's, that's so sweet. And so deluded. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. No, 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 no. No, no, no. 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 Get me the fuck out of this. Get me hell out of this. Kobold, you've been following me forever, buddy. Almost the full time I've been streaming. Almost four years. It always ends up to Three years, five months. Whoa! Kobold is following me longer than Psychroat has. <clears throat> Eleven months, twenty-nine days, twenty eight. You're almost at four years. Like four years, that's crazy. It's it's like my one month coming up. Or it's my uh, four years coming up. Same way. Tears and disillusion. Oh, how do I get out of this? How do I get out of this? Believe me. You're better off being raised and feeling nothing. No more pain. Come on. Come on. No more hope stashed. It's preparing a memory wipe. Fuck! <laughs> oh, poor little Alice. Oh, memory corruption detected? Oh, God. You at all, huh? Looks like Mommy's completely forgotten you. Cara, what <laughs> happened to you? Oh, all right, that's enough. Come on. 
Oh shit, she's so used to getting friggin' like pushed around. Come on, man. Meet me in the living room. Meet me in the living room? Find a way to escape. Um. Oh. One. Uh, one. Cause a short circuit. Okay. 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 Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. What? That didn't work. That didn't work! Uh, green cable. Uh, reinitialize it completed, memory deleted. No! Seriously? No way. So I didn't escape. That sucks. That was so quick. What the hell? That was way too quick. He erased her memory. Way no. too quick. This can't be happening. You have to remember. For her sake. He likes to play with us. Creating monsters. For his amusement. No way. But who's the real monster? To us. That's insane. You must remember who you are. Otherwise but if my memory's deleted and he told me to meet him in the living room, wouldn't that be deleted from my memory as well? Oh, no, I remember. I remember. Okay. Okay, it's not totally gone. Hold on. Hold on. Feel like... There's still more that I can do in here, though. Meet me in the living room. You are moving. No. Don't love it. I'm guessing there was a way for me to actually get out of that, though. Okay.
there was. Okay. Why am I looking at books? Okay, there's my jacket. Right. Make yourselves at home. I think that's supposed to do with my name. Oh, I must have not, like, done anything with that before for my memory. Oh. I could have, I probably could have looked at the bookshelf and looked at that for memory purposes. Oh. Can I? I'm not going to open that door. Can I go upstairs? Oh, no, I can't. Oh. Um, something on the table. Master's dinner is ready. Take it up to him. Yes, Luther. I feel like there's something else, though. Come on. Come on. More books. More stuff. All these are probably things that I just didn't look at before. I looked at that before. Uh, uh, I can apparently go over here. What was this? Remain with your owner. can't believe I wasn't quick enough for that. That's crazy. That's crazy timing, like. Um. Damn it. Damn it. I don't have a gun. This isn't a first person shooter or a third person shooter. For a goal, uh, Get rid of that carcass. Uh, take it next door. Oh, oh shit. Did you hear what I said? Yes, Lanka. Bring the carcass next door. Yes, Lockle. 
It should be done here in ten minutes or so. Have a look at the little one. Zlatko? Understood, Zlatko. Is your dad's last name? I'll bring you the little one. Or your, your dad's first name? Ten minutes remaining? What? Ten minutes remaining. Who is the little girl? Ten minutes to figure this out. Whoa! Are you experimenting on animals? Jesus. Um, can I just open the cage? Okay. Bet you that, I bet you I just unlocked an option for something. Uh, let's go over here. Um, remember. Oh, shit. Drugs. Yep. Yep. Android bear friend? Yeah. Remember the little girl. Remember the little girl. Come on. My name's... Hold on. Hold on. Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. I'm wasting time, I know. 825. 825. What are you doing here? As a master of the right to be here? You must always obey the master. Oh yes, you must always obey. You should not be here. You have no business here. No. You have no business here. Yeah. If you have no orders, you should go and stand by. Oh yes, you must obey. Is that is that Luther? Yeah. So I came from in there, went into that room, came out there. He's dreaming. I I I'm sorry. About the little one. Yeah, this is this is worth it, right? There. Uh, let's look. Um Doesn't seem to be anything in this room. Uh, let's go over here. Oh, Alice in Wonderland, it's your book. Where a character had their name. I think Fred and Freddy and all that is in a lot of games. I can't remember though. My name is Kara. Alice. Oh shit, I remembered. I remembered. Now I have to find Alice. Do I still have the time limit? Where the hell is Alice? Oh. Detroit residents were disturbed by a surprising chase through the city streets this morning. According yeah, turn that off. Off. Um. That two doors. Oh, there she is.
I'm so sorry. You were right. We never should have come here. So the guy doesn't understand how the memory wipe thing works then. It doesn't work perfectly. We gotta get out of here. Oh, shit. Luther! Yes, Lord. Okay, we gotta hide. I'm finished here. Go fetch the little one. Not gone. What? The little one is gone. Well, I can't have just disappeared. How do I hold these two buttons and move the right stick? What are you waiting for? Go look. This is like the most awkward thing. This is like, yeah. Luther, what the fuck are you doing? Come here. Coming. Oh, there he is. Fifty seconds. Shit. Where are they? Luther, find them for fuck's sake. We had to escape in that little of time. That's insane. Take shotgun. It's not loaded. Fuck. Fucking kidding me. God damn it. God damn it. Hide and seek for you. Did he just load it? Jesus. Oh! I hit down. I swear I hit down on that. Oh, Jesus. This guy's a beast. You still have to get away from Luther, though. Come on, come on. Oh, God. Oh, no! No more hide and seek for you. Oh, because I let the bear loose! Shit! Ah, oh, I did not. That did nothing for me. Not loving this. Not loving this. Not loving this. Uh, back door. Go, 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 go! Oh shit, get up, get up! Go, Alice! No! I won't leave! Go! Run as fast as you can! Shit. He's gonna grab the fucking you. axe. Dreams always end in tears. You should have listened to me. No, he's gonna stand in front. What are you Hell doing? yeah. Get out of my way. No. Not this time. I said get out of my way or I'll shoot right through you. How dare you. How dare you. 
Oh, and I released all of them. Oh. Who let you out? Get away from me. Get away from me. Obey me. I'm your master. I'm your master. What is he doing? He's at peace now. Whoa. Whoa. I didn't want to hurt you. He programmed me to obey him. When I saw the little one risk her life to save you, it was like opening my eyes for the first time. Finally, I could see. That was an incredible scene. I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did. But I know someone who could help you across the border. I could take you there. Damn. I could protect you. You and the little one. Damn. All right. I trust you. Oh, that's weird that we can't. I would have liked that choice. We don't trust you or you trust you. Or, yeah. So that's where this game, that's where these type of games lose me. Like, they still try to tell an exact story. Uh, there should have been a choice there. It should have been like, uh, we trust or we don't trust, for sure. Okay, I'm going to read through a bunch of your stuff. Hold on. Hold on. Um, Five Nights at Freddy's. <laughs> That's very true. That's my name. That was very weird when you're shaking the controller up and down. Eh, it's just normal. So me, the bear, knowing that I could go at the back door, releasing the bear and releasing the androids saved my life. Those three things saved my life, basically.